All right, hey, Joey Gregard, winning the uh, BAA mile here. Yeah. Massachusetts boy, local yeah. boy, makes good. How, how was the race today? It was awesome. I mean, I've been coming to this this weekend since I was in high school and watching this and dreaming of crossing that finish line. And I'll be, it's 25 miles shorter than I dreamed of crossing it, but I'll take it. I mean, breaking that tape on Boylston Street in front of this crowd, unreal feeling. Yeah. Yeah. And you're, you live in Boston now? I do, yeah. Boston area. Yep, yep. So how long have you been here? I've been here since September. I moved out, my wife and I, um, and I go to school, law school down the street at Suffolk University Law. So I've been training all day, and I go to law school in the evening, and it's it's great. My wife works at Northeastern, so we're just a real Boston couple, and we love it. So you don't get tired doing the law school and the... No, I love it. It's, it's uh, it brings structure to my life, and you know, running's my job, and that's my day job. And then, at the, in the evening, I love going and uh, you know, working my mind, and you know, having that sort of other other stimulus in my life. So yeah. it's been it's been awesome. This is your first year of law school. Yeah, but I'm almost done with it. Couple be a couple weeks away. Yeah. Being done. Yeah, yeah. With first, this semester. With my first year. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So it's been exciting, it's been fun, and uh, I'm just excited for the future. Yeah, and so you, who's coaching you these days? I work with Andy Powell and a few, and then a few other uh, old, uh, you know, Sam Prakel and some other guys who are just, uh, yeah, just looking for looking for a change up and everything. And all my people back in New York, I'm still super close with all of them and everything. So it's been a, a great situation, really. And I'm just kind of independent, and I I jump in with different people, work out with different people, and run on a daily basis with all different people. We gotta run together, man. We gotta meet up. Yeah, so yeah. yeah, it's been great. I, I could probably hang with you for you know if we do an easy run. Yeah, of course. Manage, That's yeah. what I'm all about. Yeah. Um, how are you feeling about your fitness? You know, going into yeah. the season, like chances of contending this season. Yeah, I mean, I've been feeling really great about everything. You know, I'm just trying to take it one week at a time, and that's the good thing about being in the school too. It just keeps me focus on the process of the daily basis, not getting too ahead of myself. So goal number one was to come here and win the race. Now goal number two will be next race I run, win that one too. Yeah. Where's that gonna be? Do you not know? sure yet. <laughs> but when it's there, that'll be the goal. Yeah. Well it seemed like you your kick seemed like it was there today. We didn't really yeah. get to see the whole yeah. run. You said you went lost to fast? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I just wanted to stay relaxed the first you know, really, I watched some old race videos, and it's, it's just all this last turn. Yeah. It's all Newberry, Exeter, Boylston. So I just knew I needed to really blast around that turn, and that's, that's, that was my entire race plan, was just relax, 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 go. So maybe I should take that onto the track. No. So do you think one day we'll see you crossing the marathon finish line for real, the 26.2 mile race? You never know. You never know. You know, I think I can definitely see myself doing it, you know, just uh, as a fun thing. And then, but who knows, you know, I'm a competitive person and you wake up that competitive spirit in the training and yeah. I've never been much of a long distance guy, but you never know, I'm not gonna rule it out. All right, well yeah, congrats on the Thanks way, Thanks a lot, appreciate it. Thanks.